So this next DIY is gonna be a fall macrame wall hanging. So I wanted it to be very natural. So again, I just went to my backyard, grabbed a stick to use for this project. Now Dollar Tree does sell some yarn, but they didn't have all of the fall colors that I wanted. So I ended up having to grab some additional fall colors. So just grab whatever colors you wanna use. For this one, I used four colors. The one thing I would do consistently on a macrame is make sure that you use about the same amount of strings and have them all be about the same length. So I just grabbed something sturdy. This is a cutting mat I had on hand. So I'm gonna wrap each yarn piece around this mat 10 times. I'm gonna start with one color and cut it off at the bottom. Then I'm going to measure my stick to find where the center is and I'm gonna start by adding my pieces to the center. I'm just gonna do a simple loop knot with my yarn and I'm gonna add three colors to the center. Next, I'm going to wrap the white yarn around this cutting mat so I get six bundles all wrapped around with 10 strings. And I'll add those to my macrame. I also decided to add in this burnt orange color, so I'm going to do one on each side. Now the thing I love about macrame is you just kind of build it as you go. I'm gonna add an additional color to the outside, and you can always come in, add more colors, take away. It's just one of those fun projects to create and imagine as you go. I'm also going to use that cream yarn I did at the end to make a handle on either side. Now you can trim this at the bottom any way that you want. You could cut it at an angle. I decided I wanted it to be really natural, so I'm going to hang it on the wall and just cut it as straight across as I can. So to do that, you kind of want to comb down all the pieces and then just do your best to cut it straight across. And here's how it looks hanging in my house. Hey guys, I'm Liz and you're watching my second DIY channel where I post daily DIY videos. You may be familiar with my main channel, Liz Fibic DIY, but I'm glad that you found me over here on my second channel. Make sure that you're subscribed so you just get notified every day when I post our daily DIY video.